Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Serena, hence the intro, hence the channel name, That's So Rena. You get it corny, I know, but that's just how we are here. All right, kind of a spin off of that So Raven, but not really, you know. <laughs> you feel me, you feel me. So if this is your first video that you stumbled across, hey girl, hey, you will love it over here. Okay, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe if you feel if you so feel compelled or you feel connected in any kind of way with any of my random uh, you know commentary i i just have a really quirky personality so if you like that kind of stuff you could stick around you feel me i have my items over here that i got from pretty little thing as you guys seen by the title i went shopping girl really I went shopping because my man said you can spend this and this and this amount and I originally I was gonna go on skims but I was like it would make more sense if I did multiple hauls instead of just waste all the money on skims well not waste but y'all know I'm a Shein girl at heart so I went to Shein I went straight to pretty little thing the Shein haul let's just hope that it comes because uh right now ups lost my package so we're dealing with that on the back end but for right now we are going to be doing a pretty little thing haul so like i said all my items are right here the way i'm going to do this try on haul is kind of different than my normal usually i just try the clothes on tell y'all how i feel as i have them on but now i have already tried the clothes on so i'm going to hold them up and describe them to you and move over that's why we have this extra space right here and on this side of the screen you guys are going to see me with the items on and so let me know if you guys like this format instead but if not i could always go back to doing the other way but this way was just so much easier because i could try on the pieces have music on yeah 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 and then sit here and actually talk to you guys about my actual opinion it's still my initial opinion because it's the same day but this is just easier so let's just stop talking enough with the long intro i hate long intros and here i am doing one let's just hop right into the the uh, video i was about to say vlog y'all let's hop into the try on haul <laughs> all right so the first item that i'm going to show you are these blue textured type of pants let me again let me move over um i'm gonna read you the exact name it is the shape blue contrast knit leggings and i got them in a u.s size 8 because they have like really good stretch to them this kind of material is like body con so i know it's gonna hug onto me so i would get my real size in this so i am a size 8 um like usually in pants and stuff but when i order online i usually do sign up in bottoms but because did i say sign up or sized up <laughs> I usually size up in bottoms but because of the material that this looked like like a cable knit type of material I knew to size down and girl I knew what I was doing look at how this thing fit the body yada yada it's giving what needs to be gave so this would pair well with like you know a white solid shirt or even like if I could find a blue that is exactly like this and have it um, you know like going into it and then a like white shoe you know probably like a bubble coat stuff stuff like that even like a white um shirt and then a silver bubble coat vest and then you know white air force ones like that's how i compare it with this because sometimes in georgia it's still cold but sometimes it's not like we have snow coming up this weekend i don't know what that is about but you yeah, know <laughs> um so yeah at the bottom it's not like that um jogger type of bottom it just is a free flow bottom which i like personally because it's easier to tuck into uggs and stuff like that but who's really caring about the bottom when it's in a shoe anyway so yeah i really like these 10 out of 10 and they're very warm they feel like i don't have to wear leggings underneath you know when it's like cold cold you have to layer your bottoms like the leggings and then put your pants on this is not giving that this is giving it's going to keep me warm but make sure you cover it up on top because you want to be just as equally warm so good job with that pretty little thing so moving into a basic item this is just a basic white cotton blend v-neck now it says v-neck but it was giving very much u-neck when i tried it on um i feel like it's pulling purple on camera but it is definitely white <laughs> so yeah and then it has the button clasp to to secure it i kind of like the velcro clasp option better only because it's just 
easier access quick to get it off like when you have to use the bathroom and stuff with this if you're drunk and you're trying to re-clasp it you might struggle a little bit but at least it's only two like i've had some that are like five okay and you're just like you know what i'm not a newborn okay so yeah that's just how this looked it was very simple it can pair with anything pretty much you can just layer on top of this when you're rebuilding your wardrobe you want to make sure you have a lot of staple pieces and as i was moving and going through my clothes i realized i don't have a lot of white shirts like i have a lot of black tanks and black racer bags and stuff like that but i don't have a lot of white shirts so i was just like let me go ahead and get a white shirt body uh body suit that way if i wear jeans or anything like that it would just be all smooth and together it won't worry about rising up like i hate when this shirt rolls up so this was very very essential to get in my wardrobe all right the next top that i got was this purple knit well let me read let me read what it is <laughs> it's a lilac high neck knitted vest in the size of medium and so this is what it looked like again it's going to be very easy to pair these items when i wear them now i was very nervous that because it's like a knitted that my nipples were going to show through but it did pretty well um i still would recommend wearing like a strapless bra under here you have a lot of side boob action in this because of the way that it's a high neck so if you're bigger chested like me i would definitely suggest wearing um like a bideo underneath at least um because you know you don't want the girls flopping all around and just expose you know so yeah i don't think that it showed much through the camera like when i tried it on if so, there'll be a black bar across it, trust me. <laughs> but if not, y'all will see how it fits and all that. Um, I also like how it's not too tight at the bottom. Like I don't like, I like when clothes cinch you in, but I don't like when it like cuts off your circulation, if you know what I mean. So I really did like this because it's really not, like I, I can't even explain this. Like my friend Corey, she crochets, but I feel like she can make something like this. Corey, I'ma holla at you girl but uh yeah um this was on sale so i just went ahead and got it pretty much everything i ever buy is on sale no matter the website because this is how i shop i go to the sale put the filter for my size and then i sort it from high to low and i just scroll and scroll and scroll and scroll and scroll because i want to get the most for my money okay i'm not trying to spend a hundred dollars on two things so that's why i didn't do the skims thing as i told y'all before no shade no tea but i'd rather get 20 things for a hundred dollars than two things for a hundred dollars okay your girl ain't balling like that not yet but we getting there <laughs> all right so this is a pair of jeans it is called the multi wide leg split hem jean and i got it in a uk 14 which translates to a us 10 um these are the jeans right so they're like a mom jean as you can see because it has the long torso and then you got pockets on the back and in the front the pockets are real as i'll show you in the hall and then going down it changes into this white this dramatic white bleach stain and then split hem you know ankles so you'll see it better in the try on portion however it wasn't really fitting well like this is something i would have to get tailored because they're like the boyfriend slash mom jean feel however um it was just too long in their torso like i'm 5'3 so this is like realistic how it's going to fit if you're around my height um so this is not short girl friendly it's gonna have to get tailored it's more so tall girl friendly it would have to get tailored to be short girl friendly only for the simple fact that the bottoms are really really long like if it was cuffed maybe it would work possibly i didn't try to cuff it while i was trying it on because that's not the fit i was looking for like i'm gonna show you guys how it looked on the model versus how it looked on me <laughs> i was thinking about like pairing it with a nice perplex heel so that it would show where the wide leg split was and then i was thinking about um like a white boot type of moment and then the white body body suit so it would be white and then jean and then sudden white again like mwah. on the gram that might still happen 
I don't know. I got a trip coming up. So if that is on the gram, make sure you follow me on Instagram so you guys can not miss any of these gems that we throw in there, okay? I really do like the pants all in all. It's just that the fit on my tiny body is not, what's the word? Proportioned. That's the word. It's not proportioned for my body type. So I don't know. And then it was eating the girl booty up. Now it wasn't giving me pancake booty, but it wasn't giving me what I what I had in them blue, them blue legging type bottoms. Okay. I'm just saying, all right, let's not lie here. So yeah, I only have one more item after these jeans. I usually don't buy jeans online, but I just couldn't pass it up, you know, because they were like, they were on sale. <laughs> so why not just go ahead and experiment with the jeans? Why not? So I feel like I'm gonna keep these and get them tailored because I want that moment, that look to work and like i said i sized up in these so i got a size 10. i would not have been able to fit it if it was a size 8 simply because the waist part has no give like it's not stretchy at all so i made sure to size up in jeans now because i don't play with people's jeans people's jeans being the size chart for jeans is like a different language in different websites i don't know i don't know and i'm not about to sit here and take a measuring tape and measure my waist and do all this conversion i'm not doing all that i'm just gonna size up and if it don't work we'll just get it fixed <laughs> all right so this is the last item it is a basic charcoal gray ribbed midi dress in a uk 14 which translates to a us 10. now i only sized up in this because it's like a slinky material and I have like a gut when I eat I bloat like crazy so I didn't want that to be too sucked in and restricted because that's not giving what it's supposed to have gave so it just goes all the way down straight down a pretty basic dress if you ask me but it just can be paired up or down you can put some chucks with this a hat and you at the door or you can wear some booties with this and a trench coat and dress it up with some nice silver accessories and some nice statement earrings stuff like that maybe curl my hair y'all i could put a i could put a fit together or an instagram picture outfit because <laughs> where am i going <laughs> together very fast in my head as i sit here and talk to y'all so there's so much you could do with a basic dress like this and it's giving body adi adi baby you can't spell body without me okay in this dress <laughs> so yeah i really really like this dress i highly recommend it i did size up simply for comfort you don't have to it would definitely have fit me if i got an eight like i usually do but i dress to be comfortable i don't dress to be i mean i dress to be cute but i'd rather be comfortable over cute like i'm not about to the whole beauty is pain thing doesn't apply to me when it comes to clothes like it applies to me when it comes to my hair my lashes you know my nails getting done you know because yeah those are things i just need to do to upkeep but clothes that's completely controllable like you can find cute clothes that don't make you feel like you're about to pass out okay so that's what i got with this and yeah that was my final item in the haul so i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know what your favorite piece was i know it was kind of short but like i said i have a way bigger Shein haul coming so make sure you have your post notifications on so you can stay tuned to all my hauls and let me know how you guys like this format we are in my new room trust me a furnished apartment tour is coming because y'all know me and my man we moved in together so i'm trying to get all this set up and stuff figured out but until then Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.